everyone, welcome back. And I have a small haul from Dollar Tree and Target. Um, we went also to Kirkland's and I was in love with half of the stuff that they had there, but I was like, no, I will be back on Friday. So I will be back on Friday and I will share with you guys what I'm going to be picking up. I told the lady to save it for me on the side and she said, okay. So I'm gonna show you guys Target. Um, I really didn't do that much damage in Target. Um, I know I'm gonna go back Friday when I go to Kirkland's because it's in the same plaza because Dahlia's um, having a Easter party next Thursday and I need some supplies. And um, like I said, I didn't really wanna do just candy in her goodie bags. I also wanted to include certain things. So I found that they had um, these goldfish in like Easter basket, like in the Easter colors or something like that. So I thought that would be really cute to throw in there and then go to Walmart and then get like some stickers and like some stamps and then throw like one piece of candy or maybe no candy because they're gonna be getting candy from the Easter egg hunt. But anyways, beside that, I didn't, ha I didn't get my receipt because everything was like super cheap and I'm not returning it. So the first thing I picked up was this and um, it was 90 cents and it's for St. Patrick's Day. I know St. Patrick's Day already passed, I know, but I thought it would be really awesome to have for next year to decorate my house a little bit in the St. Patrick's theme. I also picked up this and this was 90 cents as well and it was a shamrock for St. Patrick's Day. We do like doing little things like cupcakes or just anything fun with the girls to entertain ourselves for a while. I also picked up two of these wall gels and these were both 90 cents each. They're the same with the four leaf clover or the three leaf clover, four leaf clover and um, the rainbows so I thought that that would be really cute you know the girls can put it by the sliding glass door where the pool is and um, Delia could put it in the window in front of the house things like that I also picked up these last two stickers from the Target One Spot these are the f um, puffy stickers seven count these were a dollar I don't really know what theme this is but I do have a lot of sticky notes and page flags from this theme this theme or this collection that says hello there like it love it gotta have it and then it has like a bunch of um cactuses so these were the only two that were there and i grabbed those two we went to the toy section we really saw we did see a bunch of toys that we wanted to get but when you're with the your daughter and destiny it's kind of hard to Christmas shop because she does remember certain things so when I do it I just want to go by myself and have her be surprised so I didn't get any toys but we did get like two things and they're going to be stocking stuffers for Josh and Delia so I picked up this um Ninja Turtle My Moji and um, this was 88 cents regularly $2.99 so I picked up that. If anybody knows, Josh really loves um, Ninja Turtles. So that's going to be a stocking stuffer for him. And then this um, Disney Junior Miles from Tomorrowland. This was $0.88 cents as well. And I picked that up for Dalia. They had a ton of Angry Birds as well. But I don't think she really likes Angry Birds that much. So I just stuck with those. So let me show you guys what I got from Dollar Tree. Destiny's on the floor. She's handing me stuff. So we went to two different Dollar Trees. We went to the one by our house and then the one by my mom's where she used to live. I picked up two of these dish towels. I was gonna pick up some from Target, but Walmart has them a little bit cheaper, like three or four of them stuck together. And Target was like, for two, it was like five bucks. <laughs> I just didn't wanna get that. So I just went to Dollar Tree and I picked up these little cheapy ones. And um, just in, this is just in blue. My kitchen is like a teal color with black and white. Grabbed that. Um, Destiny wanted some floaties or like 
a wannabe surfboard from the Dollar Tree, but they don't have that stuff right now. They're focusing on Easter and after Easter is done, then they focus on, you know, summer basically. So she was a little bit upset. So she just grabbed these cheap little goggles for a dollar at Dollar Tree. I also ordered some stuff from holler.com. It should be here pretty soon and I'm going to surprise them with a welcome summer basket. I also picked up this one for Dahlia. It's a kind of an imitation of Finding Nemo. That's what we call it anyways. And she will have a blast when she gets home to get in the pool. So we grabbed that. Destiny wanted some fun ones. Um, normally we had like the watermelon one or the hot dog one or the any kind of fun ones that they have. From Walmart, I went into Walmart to get one thing and I came out with that. And then I, no, we came out with two things. Came out with this and then something else that me and Destiny already ate when we were in the line. It's the Luke's um, smoke sausage, smoke sausage something um it is phenomenal here on youtube um grady's mom leanne she talks about luke's um beef jerky and um sausage jerky and it's so good i recommend it it was only like a dollar and some change and only brought three of them like a little snack pack or something like that but it was really good so i picked up this hot sauce for josh because in the meat market where we go to i normally buy them and they're um, five for five so i went last time and i totally forgot and he's been like complaining that he doesn't have any hot sauce so this is the hot sauce that josh loves um to put on his food so we grabbed that, he is going to be happy. On my um, refrigerator, there's a, sh a list and it says groceries that we need and they put a bunch of stuff. Like they said, we need a ketchup, mustard, pickles, paper towels, and forks and hot sauce. So I picked up more of these snack bags for Delia for school because you guys know I divide her AM snack and her PM snack so they know what is what. Um, because there's a ton of kids and you know when you're busy as a teacher you tend to forget which one is for who so I Like to do you know an a.m. Snack and then I label you know Delia's Delia Carico a.m. Snack p.m. Snack the same way so I grabbed this one. I needed more snack size not lunch not sandwich size and then I picked up two forks well, it's four you count there's two in there so four in total but there's two and these were a dollar at the Dollar Tree um, I don't know someone's stealing the forks and the spoons in my house apparently because we never have any I don't know why but again some spoons they bring a two in each so a dollar and then I'm going to be doing a recipe so I decided to get some stuff from the Dollar Tree. The only thing I did not get was cheese because if you guys are a Dollar Tree person, you know that the Dollar Tree cheese sucks bad. It will never melt. So I'm just going to use the Velveeta on cheese, shredded cheese that I have in my house, but I'm still going to do the recipe. So I grabbed, this is the very first time I've tried this. It says made by Italians and it's pizza sauce. Francisco I don't know this is the first time I'm trying this uh, it says um, one serving of vegetables heart healthy gluten free liquid free low fat I don't know guys it says like you can follow them on Facebook Twitter and Pinterest um salsa consistency it's smooth instead of chunky made with virgin olive oil virgin yeah virgin olive oil extra virgin olive oil i don't know so i thought it would be awesome to give that a try and then i also picked up the hormel pepperoni and original this brings like two this is two pouches two pouches and it doesn't expire until july 30th 2017 so i grabbed that to make the recipe i also grabbed some pickles because they said we needed pickles for sandwiches i also picked up a couple things of um fruit 
because I wanted to make a fruit salad, but then the Dollar Tree didn't have like the shredded um, coconut, and then it didn't have the shredded um, almonds that I wanted, and pecans and stuff like that that they normally have in the baking section. So I was like, oh, I'll just go wait until I go to Walmart on Friday, and then I'll make it on the weekend or something. Oh, well, not the weekend, because I work again. But I got some cocktail fruit, two of those cocktail fruits. And this says um, an extra light syrup because they had extra, extra heavy syrup. And I was like, oh, what? No. So I got some mandarin oranges. And then I got some sl sliced peaches and extra light syrup as well. So, yeah, that is my crazy haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for that cooking recipe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.